What's up everyone, it's Trainer Della, and in this video I have for you the Lisa, or Lisa, I don't know how to pronounce it, Shroud of Dusk Commander deck profile built by my friend Billy. Uh, he brought over two of his Angel decks and next week he'll be able to see an update on the Lyra Dawnbringer. Ooh, beautiful, beautiful card. Um, I don't really know how many changes were made to them, um, but we got that for next week. But this week, very beautiful Lisa Ill right here. Look at that. That's a very beautiful card. Two, two whites and a black. Legendary creature angel. Rather than pay two for each previous time you've cast this spell from the command zone this game, pay two life that many times. So it's like a life matters deck. It has flying and life link to help recoup some of that life loss. And also whenever a player casts a spell, they lose two life. So you got to keep your life up. Especially the player who plays this card. Uh, for the first few times we were playing, uh, we were just we weren't even taking life away from Billy. We were just like taking life away from ourselves. But it's any player, so be cautious. We're just gonna cover up Jorah's face. Uh, but yeah, it's a nice card. Uh, also, disclaimer: uh, in my play group um, and uh, some others, you might be playing with proxies now. The, the My house rule has always been if you have and own the card, like you actually own it, why spend and dish out way more money for multiple copies? I'm cool if you have proxies. Um, a lot of the people that I've played with have been adopting that philosophy. I don't even care if you don't even play the physical card at all. If you just put it in a folder, that's fine with me. I really don't care if you own it. Cool. If you don't, you know... A little lean, it, it, you know, talk to the playgroup. Rule zero, talk it out. So you will see some proxies in here with different arts and stuff. Uh, so, you know, don't be like, ah, it's a shock. That shouldn't be in there. No, this is my friend's deck. It's how he wants to run it. It's what he wants. So, you know, I respect it. I respect it. So, yeah, let's get in it with One Punch Man. Sarah Ascendant starting it off. You know, um, soul, uh, the Soul Sisters are in here with Soul Warden. And Soul's Attendant. Walking Ballista combo is in here. Walking Ballista and I believe Heliod will show up in a bit. Blood Seeker. To, you know, whenever um, a creature enters the opponent's battlefield, they can lose a life. Suture. Sutra Priest. Whenever another creature enters the battlefield under your control, you may gain one life. And whenever a creature enters the opponent's Battlefield under opponent's control. So it's kind of another soul sister in a sense. Uh, was Dryneth the Magistrate that I always said just kind of looks like Billy in a sense. Your opponents can't cast spells anywhere other from their hand. This is a lockdown card. Targeted room. You got to remove that because it can stop, you know, other commanders from coming down. Thalia, Guardian of Thraven for some stacks. Containment Priest. Flash. If a non-token creature would enter the battlefield... If it wasn't cast, exile it instead. Hold some stuff back down. Veto, because he's Veto. Some life gain can turn to life loss right there. When you gain life, target opponent loses that much life. And you can make all your creatures have life link. Marauding Blight Priest. Whenever you gain life, each opponent loses one life. Even Mind Sensor. Also some stack stuff. So there's like life gain and some stacks here. In a sense, Thalia, or was it taxes? I guess more taxes than stacks. Thalia, Heretic, Cathar. I like this art a lot. I like <laughs> the promo one. Of course, Heliod. Gotta get that Heliod combo. Resplendent Angel. Man, this card. I wish I picked up a few more. Um, I know Billy got a few because he was going to play like standard angels he was trying. This card kind of just went up recently. Drana's Emissary. Another Life Matters. At the beginning of your upkeep, each opponent loses one life and you gain a life. My boy Cumball, console of alloc of allocation. This is what's going on. You know, he's the one that's making all the Pokemon cards go down right now. Or he's the one allocating all the Pokemon cards, so talk to him. But, you know, if you try to cast a non-creature spell, then you're going to lose two life and you'll just gain two life. Kurnos, Hound of Atherios. Another cool card to just stop things. Fate Unraveler. I have not even seen this card. This card, it looks pretty cool. Whenever an opponent draws a card, then it deals a damage to that player. So, you know, careful, Blue. Careful. Windborne Muse. More taxes. 
Limbala, Keeper of the Shrine. See, this would be more stacks, right? Something like activated abilities of creatures your opponent can't control can be activated. Stops, you know, some decks more than others. Archangel Tithes. The some taxes. Archangel of Dune, some life gain and counter control right there. Some counters. Sun Scorch Regent, some more. Play spells, gain life, gain counters on this. Lyra here too. Help the angels out. Valkyrie, Harbringer. Let's see this. Flying and life, like a new card from Call Time. At the beginning of each end step, if you gain four more life this turn, create a 4 4 white angel creature token with flying and vigilance. So, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Kirk, son of Yogmoth. Man, we were playing a game one time and he just kept like <laughs> using up so much life to play all his spells. It was kind of funny. But then just gain some life back. Elish Norn, Grand Cenobite. You know, it's Elish Norn. Commander staple in some sense. Billis, Broker of the Blood. This card and Yogmoth for other, for other reasons. If you want to dig down, you could do a lot. You can pay two life and a black and target gets minus one, minus one to end of turn. But whenever you lose life, draw that many cards. So you don't even need to play his first effect. You can just lose two life with Yogmoth's ability. And then Avicen. Angel Vault proxy card here but still very beautiful sign and blood very simple old school card draw two cards lose two life or you make target player do it toxic deluge wrath of god fumigate i think those are the wraths in this deck just three wraths pretty good vampiric tutor let's go search for whatever you need to dark ritual Enlightened Tutor, another searcher right there, or Tutor. Swords to Plowshare. Light of Hope. You know, I think this card doesn't get enough play. You can gain four life, which can trigger that one card. The Valkyrie Harbringer. You know, tar destroy target enchantment if you need to at instant speed and or put a plus one, plus one counter on target creature. It's, it's an all right card. Different modes, you know, for just one white Mana, Withering Boon, one of my favorite cards in black. I just think this is such a good card. Black doesn't really get to counterspell much, but it's a cool little counterspell. Disenchant, very staple right there. Anguish Unmaking, really good card. Ad Nauseam, hate this card, love this card. <laughs> Reveal the top card of your library and put the card into your hand. You may lose life equal to its converted mana cost, and then you can repeat this process any number of times. I wish this was Enjoy or Man. <laughs> That'd be horrible. Just lose all that life or, or with zero and one mana freaking um, spells and talking about one mana spells. Sensei's Divining Top with your boy Jiraiya. That's the Sensei right there. It's cool. Soul Ring, because it's Soul Ring. Elixir of Immortality. This is one of, like, Billy's pet cards. He's been playing this card since, like, forever. One of the cards he loves to play. Arcane Signet, Thought Vessel, Lightning Greaves, Commander Sphere, Dark Steel Ingot, Aether Flux Reservoir. Oh, you know, in a life gain deck, this can do work. Bolus is Citadel. Oh, this is is this the F and M promo or something like that? Or what is it called? Draft Weekend Promo beautiful card authority of the consoles blind obedience those would be stacks would they tainted remedy another card that i love and hate at the same time if opponent would gain life that player loses that much life instead so you can hope to have other people not gain life at all ghostly prison stop them attacks Phyrexian Arena, all right card. It's it's getting pushed out little and little, I feel like, nowadays, but still a welcome card. If you can get on turn three and just draw extra cards, nothing wrong with that. Leyline of the Void, good card, good card. Angelic Destiny, beautiful art. Can I just, like, can we appreciate that right there? Who did this? Jaina Sh Shermer and Johannes Voss, beautiful, beautiful card. Boon Reflection, if you gain life, gain twice that much instead. Exquisite Blood right here with this art. And Sanguine Bond for that combo. The Wombo combo right there. Another Reflection here, but this time Wound Reflection. And then the Lands. 
We got Command Tower, Fabled Passage, Isolated Chapel, Temple of Silence, Ancient Tomb, Seraph Sanctuary, Terramorphic, Evolving, Myriad Landscape, Maze of Ith, Cabal Coffers, Blight Claim, was it Blight Climb Pathway? And then what's the, the backside? Ha! Grim Climb Pathway. Right there. Castle Lochwing. Castle Ardenvale. And then I believe 11 swamps. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 swamps. And then 10 planes. 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 planes. And that's Billy's Lisa deck. Uh, really cool. Really awesome. Um, man, this was the deck that he definitely, like, when Commander Legends was popping and we were all choosing, man, what cards we'd want to build, he obviously gravitated toward the, towards this Orzhov card right here. And I thought he was going to actually turn his angels into more of an Orzhov angel tribal. Uh, but no, nah, he just decided to build a whole new deck entirely with, you know, her own strategy. And next week, you'll see the the uh, Lyra. And I believe in so much, some parts obviously are the same. It's got little tweaks here and there. So be ready for that. I haven't even seen it yet. Uh, I'm excited to, like, profile it myself. All right, thanks for watching. Peace.